High water has been a factor in a lot more drownings than normal this year. So many, in fact, that doctors across the metro got together to send a warning to parents this holiday weekend. Eric Hansen has the story. Every time floodwaters rise across central Iowa, people are naturally drawn to them. And every time, a lot of people find themselves in trouble. Last week, a two-year-old died in a watery ditch, a seven-year-old nearly drowned at Raccoon River Park, and a man living near the Des Moines River fell in and drowned. It's been crazy. It has been very crazy. Doctors say drownings always spike in the summer, but the last few weeks have been abnormally dangerous. You know, I've driven past some of these. You know, they used to be just little creeks. Now they're running hard. And the banks are going to be slippery. Kids can slip in. It, it's just kind of a recipe for, for disaster. So today, pediatricians from Blank and Mercy pleaded with parents. Know where your children are. We don't want to lose a single child. Even when you're at a public pool. You should take care of watching your kids, making sure that even though they're in a foot of water or two feet of water or anything like that, that they could fall down and bump their head. And lifeguards are watching a lot of people, so they're asking you to learn CPR. And if there's trouble, call for help and consider doing something yourself. But remember, don't harm yourself. So if you're in a raging river or something like that, do your best. Get a string or a rope. Because if you don't know what you're doing, the tragedy can be multiplied. An important lesson every summer, but especially this weekend over the 4th of July holiday. In Des Moines, Eric Hansen, KCCI News, Iowa's News Leader. Now, by the way, a lot of swimming pool facilities offer swim classes for adults who never learned how to swim, and they warn teenagers to resist the urge to prove to your friends how well you can swim in high water.